Here you go, here, yo, look. I found the biggest Gandhi statue in India. It's right behind me. Southern India, Lord of mercy, look at it. It's huge. He's dark like Kali. If you don't know uh, Indian gods, Kali, look up Kali, you, you'll be surprised. But most definitely, you see all the flowers on him? Flowers represent that he's in the ancestral realm. Uh, when, when he was alive, they really didn't like him as much. But now he's a martyr. And so now they love him. He's all on the money. He's everywhere. So I wish they would do that to Martin Luther King, by the way. But I haven't seen a nickel or a dime. Matter of fact, I haven't seen a penny. And he was a square, brother. He was a square. He was on the square. And I haven't seen a penny. Matter of fact, they've been penniless with Martin Luther King's statue. But Martin Luther King adapted... Gandhi's non non-violence philosophy with dealing o with oppression. So no doubt you can turn around and inject you in so you can see it a little bit further. Look 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 at it. It's pretty dope. I like it. I like it a lot. And he's a dark hue black, just like the rest of these other people in southern India. They're hue dark skin. Please don't call them black people even though they are. But don't call them that, just call them dark skin because that's what they are. Uh, and look, look how beautiful it is. He, 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 he's, he's dark like Kali. If you know Kali uh, in, in Indian mythology, you know him, okay? That's the reason why they painted him. The rest of these other people are dark skin over here. So, moving, another fun fact, another fun fact that you might, might like. Check it out. Two fingers. Peace. World traveling. World living. The world is bigger than 10 square miles of where you live. Get out that joint. Go see it. God is waiting for you out there. Peace. Southern India. It's a place where dark skinned, lovely, beautiful people exist with dark, thin hair. Where India is shaped like the continent of Africa. And Lord have mercy, a lot of dark skins are here. They're even darker than them. But we all dark. We dark dark. We black. But as you can see, look at the ocean. Look how beautiful that is. Now the government I think put these these big black boulder rocks here uh, for a couple of reasons. If you know anything about erosion, then you know about why these big black rocks here. They do it all around the world, actually, and it helps with erosion. I wish you could see all the way down there. There's mad people all the way down there. Look at all of those people. It comes all the way down here. See? Look at this. Stow. So yeah. This is an interesting journey. I love to be connected to the ocean. I love to stand on the ocean. Whenever I come to places that are near the ocean, I always want to be near the ocean. The ocean for me is like a, a real place that that uh, brings us all together. Just like I was saying before I came here, I was like, uh, Indians are just in, from India. And then I started to see that they reminded me of myself. We are all one people on this planet. And, Whoever told us that we're not, that we have to take on the identity of, of, the, of, of the powers that be, the governments that be, Lord. The reality of it is that we are one people. We do the same things. A lot of the things that we do are culturally similar. We are really one people. Now imagine a world if they can imagine themselves as being one instead of identifying as American and Indian and African and Kenyan and Thailand. Think about if we were just one people. Think about that idea of itself. 
and think about what it would take for us to to you know to immerse ourselves in that identity of being one when i go around this whole planet all anything i see is one hey hey excuse me excuse me have a seat yeah so. sorry about that father at the end of the day got to tell him i have a seat on these rocky rock lord of mercy i don't want to see them hurt themselves that's my dialogue Take it as you wish. India, Southern India, I love it. I love it. I love this place. So, look, I found this tree. Looks like Mowgli from the Jungle Book. The Jungle Book, yeah. Look, look how the tree. He's inside the freaking house. That's crazy. See, it's like the tree is alive up there. If you know what kind of tree this is, let me know. Muscles getting bigger. Getting stronger. I'm going. Peace.